Hi guys, and welcome to Little Known Galaxy, where we have something from Robert about a space pack. Dear valued customers, just a reminder that space pack upgrades are still available at our shop. We can add more inventory slots to your space pack today. Stop on by for details and pricing, Robert. All sales are final. Okay, cool. So we only have the restoration ray, so I'm just going to put that on my hotbar. So, okay, so these are our missions. We still need three people. This is our calendar, and it tells you everyone's birthday, so that's kind of nice. Manufacturing date, that's cute. Yeah, okay, cool. And then the crew, this is our relationships with everyone. Wow. Meeting lots of people, and then this is our map. There's maps for each little area, so that's kind of nice. And I am currently Captain Level Trainee, so it looks like we could level up. What's Tally then? No idea. Now, oh, I see. So is this everything that we found and produced in yada yada yada? I think so. And like planted? I think so. Because it tells us right here what like the crops, machine production, machinery, xeno items, recipes, resources, artifacts. Resources, yeah, do we, we already found dark matter. So it's definitely something that um, it tells us what we found and whatnot. And how many we found. Oh, and then elite captain. I don't know what we need to... Oh, unlock all achievements for the elite captain. Depart for a new planet for a new adventure. I see. So these are all like the achievements we can get in this game. This is my name. Oh, we can change our ship name. So if I figure something out that's better, I can definitely change it. <laughs> I didn't know what I was going to name it for real. And that's quit. Okay, cool. I just wanted to take a look at that. What is going on here? <clears throat> Hi, Captain. I have been looking forward to meeting with you up here on the Captain's stack. As the botanist and agricultural specialist <laughs> on board, I've been growing the bulk of the ship's food crops. To be honest, it's a big task, but with your help, I think we can do it together. Do you think you'd make a good spaceship farmer? Um, on the ship? I'm not sure. Definitely. I think I totally can be. Oh, thank you so much. Well, to produce anything, you will first need to build machines. <laughs> machines and decorations can be crafted on your workbench. Okay. There are indoor machines like planters that will be marked with an indoor icon. Sweet and outer hull machines like solar panels that will be marked with an outer hull icon. These types of machines must be built on the outer hull. Here is a basic planter, but planters and machines won't work without power. You will see the power icon flash when it needs power. Let's head to the outer hull and I'll show you how to generate power. Okay. Ooh, in our space uniforms. To generate more power, just build another solar panel to collect all the solar energy around us. The ship's HUD power display will also help you keep track of how much power you are generating and how much power your machines are requesting. Here, you can have this solar panel to get you started. Awesome. 
Let's head back inside and I will tell you more about plants. Now that your planter is powered, just press the left mouse button on it while holding some seeds. Okay, see how easy it is. You can have the rest of the potato seeds I harvested this morning. Well, thank you, Lynn. Five potato seeds. Planted seeds will need to be watered every day until they are ready for picking. See the difference between a watered plant and a dry plant? This is the watering pack I usually use. Also, thank you, Lynn. You're so generous. You can get new seed types from Robert in the general store. Also, any extra crops you grow can be sold to gain credits as well. Bring me some of your potatoes when they are ready and I'll know you have the hang of things. And thank you, Captain. It's nice to have you on board. You're so nice, Lynn. Thank you for everything, girl. All right, so now, use the planter and seeds to grow the crops Lynn requested. Okay, so, okay, I have the one. Okay, cool. <laughs> just trying to figure things out. Okay, so do we just put them in here then? We do. I see. Totally no. Beautiful. Yes, I realize I have to water my crops. <laughs> now, can we do anything with these footprints? I can. Ah, that's kind of nice. Okay. Watering puck. Beautiful. Sweet. That's so cute. Okay, so I did that. Okay, now we just got to wait for them to grow. All right. Three, three potatoes. Okay, not five, but it's fine. It is absolute fine. Okay, so where didn't we go? Oh, what do we need to build here? A solar panel. We do not have, okay. What do we need then? 40 metal scrap, five recycled parts, and three hardware parts. Let me see what we have in our chest over here. Because I think I'll need that solar panel to power up one of my my seed beds or whatever. I know that's probably not enough, but <laughs> but we'll see. Oh no, that's definitely enough. For sure, for sure. Okay, cool. I already had a solar panel. Why do I do this to myself? It's fine. You can never have so many solar panels. So can, do I just like put it down? I'll do a whole head outside. Oh, the she just told me, oh, wow. Outer hall. Now, is this the outer hall? I'm gonna assume, right? Yes. Because I apparently need to do that. Power up my stuff. So, like, there's a slip panel here for power. Do I just like put the solar panels down? Just anywhere? What's this then? Oh, okay. It's an upgraded tool required. Can I do this one then? I can. That's also dark matter. So, what's with the stars then? Can I do stuff? Yep. What are those then? No idea. Scrap metal. Okay, cool. Okay, so it's generating four power. So does that mean now, hold on, I wanna, what's this then? Oh, upgraded tool required, okay. Well, I'm just gonna put these couple solar panels down, I guess, huh? Let's see what it does. <laughs> I think that's what I need to do, right? Let's see what our planters are doing. 
I don't know if it's like immediate thing or what, but yep, okay, that's all I needed to do. So that's not too bad. Slowly but surely doing this for sure. My inventory is a hot mess for real. So six. I don't know if we've been on level six yet, but we do need to find three more people anyway, so sweetness. here then what does this do anything no it's just decoration what's this then cargo elevator run supplies right into the general store got it all right awesome well, this is like a little basketball court this hoop is very used and the netting is falling apart well that's not great there's no one really up here, so... Hmm. Unless there's someone in here? There's two people in here straight away. That's so good. Okay, and then we can buy... What can we buy? What is that? Those are wires. Okay. Recycled parts, hardware parts, and scraps, it looks like. From here. Gorgeous. All right. Hi, Steven. Hi, I'm Steven. I live aboard with my grandparents and little sister, Kendall. If you meet her, try and not to mention anything about G-H-O-S-T-S. -S. <laughs> That's funny. She acts tough, but I think she's a little shaken up these days. It's not her fault, though. Things have felt creepy and isolating since we arrived at the Grey Planet. Construction bot is waiting for his next assignment. Hi, Edward. Have you been to Chip's Canteen yet? Mmm, good cooking there. But I usually have to eat at home when Piper is attempting to cook. <laughs> okay, so there's one person more that we met. Let's go on level 7. We have not been to level 7 yet. These console readings are really complicated. But I think all of those flashing lights mean that the engines are working. Well, that's good. That's very good. Hardware parts. Beautiful. There's something shiny right here. I don't know. Oh, scanning. Access denied. Oh. So is there like a level further than level 7? Interesting. Or like a special level? Hi, who are you? Stuart, this job is so thankless. And honestly, it's not really that challenging for me. Did we meet you yet? We must have met you. Oh, I can't remember who we met and who we didn't meet. Wait, so why did you... Oh, you didn't have a quest or anything. Okay. Six, level seven. I just want to keep going on the levels until we meet everyone, you see. Because I literally got two more people. <laughs> two more people. Ugh. What's wrong? My grandma says I can only bring one dolly to tea time. Oh, well, that's not nice of her, is it? <laughs> Huff. I mean, how can I choose? That's true, girlfriend, but sometimes you don't need so many toys at the table, hun. Shinji. Hey, I'm Shinji. <laughs> but I'm not really part of the crew. My family paid for my room and board, so I'm just studying remotely. No offense, but I wish they would have picked a less rundown ship. I mean, how old is this ship anyways? I'll catch you around, Emily. See ya! I think we met you already. You're the doctor, right? Yep. How did you discover what kind of hobbies you enjoyed? 
I was instructed to mind medicine, but I don't think it classifies as a hobby. Nope. Although, completing lab tests is something I always look forward to. That's all that matters if you look forward to your job. So nobody up here. There is something I can collect though as well. Five credits! We're getting rich off of this stuff. <laughs> Just like finding money on the floor, it's so good. So is there anyone up here? Is this what I'm missing this whole time? <laughs> Cause there's like literally one more person that I need to meet. Yeah, these are gonna be both access cards, huh? Yep. Such a cute little game. Love it, love it, love it. My problem is I can't remember who, who I met and who I haven't met. I probably met you. I just met you. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Did I meet you? Yeah, I, meet, I met you. In my spare time, I enjoy watching funny cat videos. They have interesting techniques to engage in and increase the amount of tension they re receive. I am going to download more info on becoming a pet owner. That would be useful. Hi. Gosh almighty. Although complete, okay. Is there anything up here then? No, okay. Just one more person. I'm pretty sure anyway. Yeah, one more person. Who is that person? Why am I holding a nail? <laughs> like for real. I've already been in here. Oh my gosh. So who is this person then for real? Driving me nuts. Is it you? Robert, back now. Back at the old spaceport, I had to load and unload at least five vessels a day to keep the community running smoothly. The traders back then were quite savvy, so I picked up a few tricks on how to get the best deals. Ay ay ay. We can go slower, but we can't run faster. Hi Jimmy, what now? Oh sorry, I thought you were someone else. So you're the new captain. Yes, that's our last one. I'm so happy. Well, you don't look like the other captains, but you'll have to work as hard as me to gain everyone's trust. I suppose you'll be heading down to the Grey Planet soon. Sounds kind of exciting, but I'll be stuck here if you need me. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, so now I have to go talk to Kater. Now, does it tell me where they are by chance? I'm not quite sure. Can't remember where Kato would be for real. <laughs> Does it tell me? Kato, hold on. Does it tell me? Chief Science Officer. So obviously, she is going to be down on level two. I'm pretty sure, but I want to see what this board is all about first as well. Oh, okay, so this is like, like a bulletin board, like quests from different people. To whom it may concern, I am seeking specific objects that I will purchase on delivery. Please bring the following to my attention if you are interesting, interested. Cordially, Doc, give one food ration. Don't know what that is, so not right now. Okay, so it's gonna have that exclamation mark there. Hi, did we meet you? Probably. I'm usually in the gym planning new workout sessions for the crew. My work is never done. Nope. Okay, cool. So, level two. We're gonna go back to Kata. And tell her we met everyone. Is K 
key to the left. Why? <laughs> oh, it's night mode already. Holy crap. Kata. You're not Kata. Are you Kata? I'll get it sooner or later. No, you're Lynn. Okay. And it helps ground us back to nature too. You're not Kata. You're Francis. Hi, how are things going on the ship for you? Remember not to overwork yourself. Stress is as bad as any other illness. Okay, so hold on. Let me see. Black hair. Black long hair. Hmm. I'm not sure what's going on outside, but if you hear that, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like a little banging noise. Okay, da. I thought you would be on this level. Maybe not. Maybe I read her description wrong. Hmm. What's your description again, hon? Chief, yeah, Chief Science Officer. Crew quarters. Really? Wow, I thought it was on the science level. I mean, it makes sense to me, right? She's probably asleep now. <gasps> She's probably asleep now. Yay. Go figure. Not Shinji. What's this then? Collector's edition. No, well, obviously we're gonna have to come in here tomorrow. Find her tomorrow, cause it's just too late. It's too late. 10 p.m. already. Yeah, we're gonna go back home. We're gonna go sleep. First thing we're gonna do. When I wake up, is uh, we're gonna go find Kata. Oh, there she! <laughs> I found you. Great job, Captain. I'm glad to see you have met everyone. Remember to check in with your crew often. They may need your help or can offer you advice from time to time too. In fact, I think Edward just mentioned that your shuttlecraft should be up and running now. Awesome. You can use it to travel down to the Great Planet and start investigating the relic. I've been researching the elements on the surface to see if I can make any scientific connections. So far, though, I haven't picked up on anything significant. But before you head down, let me give you some tools to take with you. This shovel is useful to dig up sandy, a sandy areas on the surface. Thank you. And take this laser blaster to break up rocks or defend yourself from any aggressive critters you may run into. Thank you. I'm going to stay on board and continue my research in the lab. Head to the shuttle bay when you are ready and Edward will meet you there. Good luck, Emily. All right. That might be for next episode. Definitely going to be for next episode. All right, gotta go home. Because it is 10.45 p.m. for real. Like, oh my god. Oh. Again, I don't know if there is a pass out time in this or what, but I would just like to go to sleep at a decent time. Shovel, dark matter, we'll put that in there. Watering pack, we don't really, well, we'll need that for next episode. So we'll keep the watering pack. Harder parts, okay. I just want to like, have it be as clear as possible. So yeah, okay, cool. So yeah, I am going to end the episode there. If you liked it, do give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of this game as I will be playing loads of it, go ahead and subscribe and I will definitely get those out for you guys and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.